And now before we will speak about adhesive, I just want to explain also a little bit about adhesive because dispersion-based adhesive is not dispersion-based adhesive. They are different. And today uh, we will speak about two, one or two products. It is, let's, let's start with the, let's call them classic adhesive, the wet set adhesive. Wet set adhesive means you apply the adhesive on the floor, wait your five to 10 minutes so that the water can evaporate up in the air and down into the leveling compound and then you start your installation of about 15 to 20 minutes depending how uh, how the adhesive is designed for sure don't get me wrong every time when i'm talking about airing time or waiting time there is not really a waiting time because if you are applying let's say vinyl sheet and you got your five pieces two meters by i don't know 10 meters you will put it anyway in the half and you will start applying the adhesive and after i don't know two or maybe three uh, pieces that are five by ten, you start the installation from the first one. So there is never a waiting time or a really a waiting time. So you apply adhesive and then five minutes. Anyway, any installer, they don't look at the clock. They have the best clock. They see if it's ready or not by using their finger. They know when it's a little bit sticky. It is also a kind of experience, but um, they figure it out when it's the right time to install. So this is the wet set adhesive, if you want it like that. If you wait too long for a wet set adhesive, so half an hour, 45 minutes after the airing time, very possible that the adhesive would be dead. So it won't have any connection anymore. This is classic wet set adhesive with very high shear strength at the end. Then more and not more and more, actually very, very common and very loved by the installer are the so-called pressure sensitive adhesive. You apply the adhesive, Wait longer, a little bit longer, so means not 5 to 10 like a wet set, maybe 25 minutes, and then you got an open or a working time of about 80 to 100 minutes. This uh, specific for the Vacol 3320. Some others longer, some shorter, but now it comes to the very important thing. Also, a pressure sensitive adhesive has to fulfill some requirements, which means after 24 hours, one newton per square millimeter by pull strength shear strength and a lot of pressure sensitive adhesive that blame to have three four five six hours of working time they do not fulfill these requirements now people say i don't care about uh, the the shear strength because it's important for me it sticks and i go home and take my money yes but no because do this in a hospital with PVC and there was not enough power after because he installed after three, four, five hours. And then you will see what will happen, especially when they start moving the, I don't know, just an empty hospital bed is around 200 kilo. And then you will see what will happen if you have 200 kilo divided by, I don't know, maybe like that, if they are punctual on, uh, on the wheels and they move it around. Then you will see how nice the floor covering will also start to move because they installed in pressure sensitive and not enough power. Also the 3320, which is also an amazing pressure sensitive adhesive, you can install next day. It will be a tachyfier. So only a fixation, it will be sticky. I promise you it will be sticky, but it won't give you the power which is needed. And that's what you need, especially when you are doing a hospital, for example, you will get in problems. For sure, you can also install LVT, definitely. But also with a pressure sensitive adhesive, it works totally fine. But coming to pressure, to pressure sensitive adhesive and let's say in, in general LVT, quality of the LVTs really goes down. And when we talk about pressure sensitive adhesive and wet set adhesive, a wet set adhesive will every time give you the higher shear strength. Simply, I know it's a little bit crazy to say that it will penetrate because we are talking at least about dense products. So there is not really a penetration, but it, you will have a little bit more transfer into the backing of the LVT or also PVC uh, sheet, and that will give you more strength to the floor, especially when the crazy thing stop, uh, starts uh, happening. So movement, solar, like we see in an amazing picture over there. I would like to have this house, by the way. Also high temperature, uh, also there when you start doing the installation, 
all dispersion-based products, also from other competitors, to get their really high strength, they need three days. So please, if possible, make sure that the solar power that is coming to the window, at least for this three, two, three days, they do not have 100% uh, solar on top on the covering, just that the adhesive got his power. This is the first step, but also the covering many times should be, um, yeah, how can I say, allowed to be installed in high temperature areas. I know that you won't find this necessary in the recommendation, because then they blame you yeah, that the adhesive is not strong enough, but don't get me wrong, at the end, LVT, it's plastic. And we all know what we put in front of uh, what happens if plastic gets heat. Not more, not less. So that's why also the products have to be a kind of design, therefore. So you're also referring to, when you're referring to not quite the penetration, but I think you, the word we're looking for is the crab strength. Yeah, yeah, no, it is, it is actually really, it is really the penetration because the, if you would compare, uh, honestly, the uh, pressure sensitive adhesive with the initial grab strength and the wet set one, you would have in mind and you would prefer the pressure, the sticky face adhesive because the first feeling, it will be stronger because it's already, how can I say, more in already re the reaction. The wet set, if we put here 3320, wait 25 minutes, 3307, wait just 10 minutes and we will pull both out, you will have here definitely more power. But if we measure tomorrow, you got here the highest power possible. So because of the wet set, it will, once again, penetration is the wrong word, but it will, let's, let's say it will grab the backing better than a, a pressure sensitive adhesive. Don't get me wrong, 3320, the advantage of the pressure sensitive adhesive is simply you can apply bigger areas and you have a little bit more secure if you do not work as fast or if you are not so experienced in that uh, application way. Otherwise, Honestly, I recommend the 3307 and for LVT, honestly, the easiest way, uh, apply as much adhesive as your arm is uh, in length, because that's also the same way that you can uh, install your LVT. For vinyl sheet, it is a little bit like, how is the job site designed, let's say it like that, because like I mentioned before, if you got, I don't know, five pieces of vinyl sheet, which is mostly two meter in width, and then it could be whatever, 10 meters, you will every time put this in half and start the installation. And if you finish two, three, two, three lines, then you can also start installing the PVC and put over the other side. So it's every time related to the job site. Sorry, Alex, I yes, sir. With regards to both glues, what is the green strength like? In other words, the ability to disperse heat as evenly as possible over a wider period because I know that certain glues have what they call the green strength, the ability to distribute heat. So when you have a floor that's exposed like that has lots of sun, vinyl is hypothermal sensitive, so therefore it's going to heat up like that. Mm -hmm. um, are both glues equally capable of when that heat transfer comes through to distribute that evenly because we know that when glue gets too hot it starts to... So in the moment when after these three days you should give him these three days to be completely cured before he is uh, completely, um, uh, yeah, the sun will uh, touch it, then nothing will happen anymore. But also there, for sure, you cannot, in many, many houses, you cannot make sure that for three days there is no direct sun uh, on the floor covering. At least for the first 24 hours, and then you are fine, because you would, won't have sun, also not in South Africa in the night, so it will be time that the floor is, uh, or the adhesive is curing or relaxing, if you want it like that. But for sure, as longer you can avoid that you have really high solar gain, as better it is, at least for this first two to three days.